What's good, YouTube? It's your boy K Flex, and I'm back here with another video. And uh, Road to 5K underway, guys. And uh, this is not what the video's about, but let me just go ahead and clarify some shit real quick. Okay, two videos, two videos ago, all right, I I made a Richard Sherman video how about how the Dolphins need to try to go get Richard Sherman, okay? And it was like a badly reviewed video, okay? Everybody was commenting, oh, this is your worst. I, literally, somebody commented, and they were going about to unsub to me because I thought the Dolphins should go after Richard Sherman. Another person commented, said this was my worst video I ever fucking made. You don't believe me? Go check. Go, go check the comments on that video. All right, it was about two videos ago. It's about the Richard Sherman one, okay? Now, let me tell you something. Now, today, fast forward to the day, he gets released, and the uh, statistics come out, and guys, y'all have read them. Read them. Interceptions first. Pass defense first. Blah, 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 first, first, first. Just, just read. Pause the video and just read. Hold on, hold on. Let me go. Let me, let me uh, scroll up real quick. Pause the video and just read it. Anyway, that's not what the video is about, guys. But it, it, it's really neat. like, but people was acting like I was just insane for wanting the Dolphins to get Richard Sherman. I still don't understand it. But anyways, guys, here's not what the video is about. Uh, I don't. I really don't care. There's a lot of people that just watch Dolphins games and don't watch no other team, so they think that Richard Sherman apparently sucks now. But it, it, it don't matter. Let's let's all get to the video. So rumor has it that the Miami Dolphins apparently, allegedly, considering releasing. The, uh, uh Nadama Kasu. Why? 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 Now, I don't understand this move. You, I mean, I do understand this move because it's the Miami Dolphins, okay? We're about to get rid of our most consistent offensive player for the last few years. So let's just go ahead and get rid of our most consistent defensive player as well. Nadama Kasu. Go ahead, Dolphins. Do whatever you want to, motherfucker. It's going to be some people who defend everything y'all do. So, so keep doing it. Just enable them to do this shit. Now, for people that's just stat whores, okay, stat whores, I, I'm sorry, I, for lack of a better term, I'm going to call y'all stat Bruh. whores. Stat whores are people that just look at stat, uh, look at numbers all day. All right, they look at numbers and say, oh, this player's good, this player's bad, okay? They don't cons they don't watch the game, they just look at the numbers and be like, oh, oh he's he's good because he has eight interceptions. Oh, he's terrible because he only has two interceptions. Blah, blah, blah. Stat whores, okay? Stat whores are going to say, oh, Sue only had, what, five, four, and five sacks last year? He's not worth it, okay? But people who actually watch the game understand he gets double teamed every single play. You know what I'm saying? So it's kind of hard for him. He, he does what he's supposed to do, okay? He gets double teamed every play um, and frees up everybody else for one-on-one -on -one opportunities and they have to just be able to make a play. Uh, unfortunately, when we got Andre Branch, he can't make a play. Uh, but I'll... As far as on the field, Sue has been our most productive player. Now, is he worth the money, though? That, that's the thing. Is he worth the money? I don't fucking know. This is the thing that I don't like about Sue. I love his productivity on the field, but the thing about it is, dude, take a fucking pay cut. You don't have to take a pay cut. Restructure your fucking contract, dude. Stop being like that. I just read an article not too long ago. Uh, Antonio Brown took a, a restructure his contract so that the Pittsburgh Steelers could re-sign Le'Veon Bell. I repeat. Antonio Brown, or not re him, but put him on, under the franchise tag, okay? So, think about it. If Antonio Brown can restructure his contract to fit people in, why can't he the Dominic Kunsu? He, he acts like he can't do it, and that's the thing. You f***ing up everything, acting like you can't just restructure your f***ing contract. That's the only problem I got with him, but... I other than that, I, I like Nadama Kunshu, and I don't think he should get released. Uh, uh, definitely not released. It would save us a lot of money over the next three years. But goddamn, but it's just not worth releasing him and the job. It's, it's just too much, okay? It's just too much at one time. You got to go gradually with this shit because yeah, right now, it's too much going on. First of all, we're going to replace him. Like, it just, it's just... But I believe Miami would do some shit. It's just a rumor. I don't think... I think Miami Dolphins just need to go ahead and end this rumor right now. Guys. It's just a rumor... Uh, but it, it, I wouldn't be surprised, put it that way. I, I just wouldn't be surprised if it happened, and that's kind of sad, but it, it probably might happen. Also, guys, I was thinking about at the end of every day, probably like 8, 9 o'clock, I'll drop a video of all the moves that happened in the NFL, my reaction to it. Let me know if you guys would want that video, because I, I don't want to keep making, like, so much happens every day. I would have to make eight videos a day to, to do every trade and everything. But uh, I do like a round the NFL type video every night as long as free agency is going on and shit because it's going to be a lot of moves. Let me know what y'all if y'all guys like that idea or not because I might start that tonight or tomorrow. But I would still just do the Dolphins video separate and shit like that. But anyways, guys, if the Dolphins release suit, it's one of the most... Maybe that that's what it would take for, uh you know... A lot of you guys to admit that the owner is on crack, uh, or not the owner, but whoever, like whoever's making these decisions, is on is on Molly. Because obviously, you know what I'm saying, all the decisions they made previously is always going to be some defenders. But I mean, if this move happens and you and you stack this up with all the rest of the moves that's happening, 
we can finally understand that somebody is on Molly on the organization and we can move on and we can actually get these drug tests administered. I personally don't think the Dolphins are this dumb. Let me know what you guys think. Like, comment, subscribe, roll to 5K. Like I said, we trying to hit 5K soon, man. I'm trying to really, really do this. With that being said, I'm out. Uh, I remember I wanted for the crystal many times. But I knew this moment to come. Now it's my time. I gotta make a fall. Them nights that my mama cried. I'm going in, I'm putting.